Hey, it's Victor Jimenez from BicycleLab.com and The Fluent Cyclist. And I get this question often, and it's one of the things I talk about in my online basic bicycle maintenance class. What is the best tool for changing flat tire, for changing a tire? You know, I always have trouble changing a tire. What can I do, and what's the best tool to use? Well, the short answer is, this is the best, hand, best tool to use right here, your hands. Um, in the class, I do teach a method and that teaches you how to change a tire by hand with no tools. Although, there are times when you definitely need tools to change a, a tire. So I'm just gonna show you uh, three different ones that, that uh, I recommend. This is the most basic one. It's called a tire lever. There's lots of different brands. This particular one is a park tire lever. Uh, they usually come in threes. These are great, but they do uh, break. And uh, if you're not careful, you can puncture the, the tube while you're putting the tire back on. The name of this is called a quick stick. Uh, same kind of concept as this. It has a little lever at the tip. Um, it has a blunt edge and it's a little bit bigger and beefier, stronger tool. These are great and it is more difficult to puncture your tire with this type. Lastly, this is kind of a biggie, but this is something to, uh, to have at home. Uh, it's called a uh, tire jack, I believe. Uh, I can't remember who makes it, but this is an excellent tool. I love this thing. Um, this is for pro getting problem tires on. It doesn't help you get the tire off, but it helps you get uh, problem tires on. This, this is a great thing to have in your home toolkit. So anyway, that's just three of the many basic tools that, that you can use to change a flat. At the Fluent Cyclist, which is my online learning site, check out my basic bicycle maintenance class. We go in depth into all these tools, why you need this one, why you need the other one, how to use them, how to use hand-free methods, how to take care of your bike. We don't get into taking your bike completely apart. And, what I want you to do is learn to take care of your bike and do basic roadside repairs. So go over to fluentcyclist.com and check that out. Thanks for watching. It's Victor Jimenez from bicyclelab.com.